Lakins, so this week's video is going to be my updated room tour, of course, as promised. I'm super, super excited. I'm super happy. I feel like I've decluttered my life a little bit. Uh, it's not 100% completely done, but totally fine. So let's just get started. Alright, so sorry about the yellowish lighting, but starting how I did last time, this is the entryway to my door. The beads I got from Greece, so I don't know where you can purchase the exact ones, but let's enter. Alright, so standing at the doorway here, here is an overview. overview. Please note that those two things will be gone. I just have to keep them on my walls until my mom puts them away safely, but yes, they are gone. So starting over here, my beautiful light switch, and uh, one of my favorite pieces in my room is this mirror. I do want to possibly get some like white candles to put on here. I'm not really sure yet. And I want to put something on here in memory of my grandma and grandpa because this mirror was in their house and I took it and spray painted it. Moving along, I got the nine drawer Alex situation. <laughs> On top here, I have a picture from an amusement park that me and my cousins went to, and it's quite funny. I just have some candles from Bath & Body Works. I have some lipsticks. This container is from eBay, and I'm going to quickly run through um, these drawers. Second drawer, I don't have anything in except for some extra baskets. I uh, don't know what I'm going to put in there yet, so it's just empty. Third, I have sunglasses and some like travel containers where I can put shampoo, conditioner, hairspray, etc. Fourth drawer, I have my camera stuff, my cords, headphones, chargers, stuff like that. Phone cases in this basket and my camera box. Next, I have some, uh, what are these called? What are you called? Fake tanners. Um, some more fake tanner, some more fake tanner, some more fake tanner stuff. I have some extra candles back here from Mason, and I have one of these, like, lint roller things because I have a dog and, you know, it's annoying. Next, I have nail polish in this drawer and nail polish in this drawer oops we've got a situation here there we go the second last drawer is kind of like bath and body stuff so soap moisturizer body scrubs body gels and the last drawer if i can open it is like period stuff so you know <laughs> okay now on my dresser I repainted this white just to give it a nice fresh coat I have a flashlight here and some more lip products here in the center here this mirror was my grandma's so again i really wanted it to be like the center of attention because it's beautiful and i just have like body sprays and perfumes and like little sample perfumes and stuff like that on this side i have another lipstick thingy bob with some uh lip what do you call it lip glosses kind of thing I have a mirror that I use to do my makeup, which is from Walmart. Really, really handy. I highly, highly recommend it. It's amazing. And then this is actually like a foldy chair. Um, I only use it when I do my makeup. So when I'm not doing my makeup, it is in my closet. 
I also changed out the hardware on these drawers because they were outdated. So in this drawer I have pajamas, cardigans, pants, bras, socks, and underwear, shirts, and more pants. Now the second tower, I have three more candles and another lipstick organizer with uh, lip, what are these called, lip liners and glosses. So in this tower, this one is more like my makeup -y tower. In here I have tools and like a little cloth thing that I use to like remove makeup, which I obviously did not do. And just like some tweezers and matches to uh, light my candles, some eye drops, and Q-tips. Next is face and foundation. So I have primers in here, foundations, foundations that are too dark or that I don't particularly love, setting sprays, extra foundation. Next, I have bronzers and highlights in here, concealers and powders, blushes in here. I have eyeshadow stuff in here, singles, eyeshadow bases, eyeliners, mascaras. Back here I have fake lashes and what are those called? Uh, more eyeshadow palettes. Next, this is kind of like a random drawer. Since I have most of my uh, lip products displayed, this is kind of like the lip product drawer, but like not really. Uh, so it's kind of like a random one for now. <laughs> Next is where I keep my hot tools, straightener, curling wand, hair dryer. This is my hair drawer. As you can see, it's very messy. So I just have like a bunch of stuff in here, like clips, hair bands, hairspray, dry shampoo, brushes, conditioner, god knows what else. Next is skincare. This basket right here is like what I use daily. Uh, makeup wipes, oxy pads, moisturizer, spot treatment, makeup remover, face washes, some more extra stuff, um, extra moisturizer, some more face stuff. Um, bio oil, some sunscreen, and the last one is makeup bags. Over here I just have a uh, power bar with my garbage and uh, like my uh, Mac cord, MacBook Pro. So above my bed here I have this perfect picture, but I purchased that at Walmart. I'm not sure what I'm going to put here. So moving along, sorry, it is kind of raining. Um, I had another like lacy curtain here, but I took it down. It lets more light in and I just like this one better. So here is my bed. The bed is still the same. I did paint the headboard and the um, like basey thing because again, I just wanted a nice fresh coat of paint on there. I have a piggy from Sears. This little sand thing is from uh, Niagara Falls. My lamp is from Ikea. The alarm clock is from Walmart probably. I just have some like paper and stuff down there in case I need to like jot something down. I have three drawers here so I will go through those. Ooh. So first drawer here I have like uh, workout stuff and like professional um, like dress pants and stuff like that. Next drawer is summer clothes, shorts, etc. And in here I have extra shampoos and conditioner and uh, dry shampoo, nail dryer, and those acrylic things that I use to store my makeup in, but they don't uh, fit under or in the IKEA shelving thing. So, yeah. Um, my blue pillow, which I freaking love, is from Walmart. This 
bedspread thing is from Sears. The body pillow is from... Oh, I'm tired. The body pillow is also from Walmart. Again, removing that. Don't know what I'm going to put there yet. Removing that. Um, I really want to get... The lighting is really like bright in here. It's kind of like greeny. Like a green yellow. Sorry about that. But here I want to put one of those like three framed pictures. Like a canvas like that, but it's in like three pieces. So I really want to get one of those. So again, ignore this. It's gone. And I just have a little clock there and I still have not put in pictures so they're just like random people for now. This does tick at night so it is a little bit weird to get used to. So here I have a long mirror and in my closet on the door here I have my jewelry and I have mostly sweatshirts and my robe and some like belts and stuff. I also have my dirty laundry in here so let's not look at that. And here I also have like my luggage set and again that is where that fold out chair thing goes. This is my second favorite piece to my bedroom which is a sheep fur rug. I bought it from Ikea. It is so soft. It is amazing when I get out of bed and I rest my feet on that especially now since I do have um like a hard floor it's really nice in the morning so that is my second favorite piece to my room all right and that is everything in my room if you want me to go in more depth or something like that or if you have a question about something that I didn't talk about or anything at all, then please leave a comment down below letting me know so I can answer you. And I'm really, really happy with my room. It's turned out pretty well, I think. And um, I hope that you guys like it too. Oh, look at that mirror. I love it. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Finally, I think I waited, what, a year, a year and a half for my room to be done. So it's finally, finally done. Super excited. And I will catch you next weekend in my next video. Toodles!